Hello, this is BBC World News. I'm Ben Bulos. These are our top stories. The UK's top court rules that WikiLeaks founder Julian Assange can be extradited to face charges in the United States. His partner spoke outside court. Julian represents the fundamentals of what it means to live in a free society. Dozens of people, most of them migrants from Central America, are killed after their truck overturned in Mexico on the brink of famine as thousands face catastrophic conditions in Madagascar. Aid groups say climate change is to blame. And standing up for freedom of expression, two journalists from the Philippines and Russia are awarded this year's Nobel Peace Prize. Hello and a very warm welcome to BBC World News. The US government has won its appeal at the High Court in London over the extradition of the WikiLeaks founder Julian Assange. Two senior judges ruled that he should be extradited. Hello. Hello. How are you today? I'm fine. Great. And you? I'm doing very well, thank you. So what is new? What? What? You? <clears throat> One second. I'm sorry, I have some problems with my microphone. I understand, that's not a problem. So what is new? What is what? What's the last word? What is new? Ah, what is new? Uh, well, today I, I wrote um, an English contest, the English contest, hmm, what's all? What kind of a contest? Um, I don't know how in English is Olympiada. <laughs> that's Olympia. That's the same word. Olympia. Yes. Okay. Just tell I'm me. I'm an only one today. Yes, you are the only one today. Okay. So tell me a little bit about this contest. Um, it. It was hard for me. I'm I'm not in in English, so I I tried to <clears throat> write um, in in the middle of files, maybe. Um, I I did my best. <laughs> I understand. I understand. So. Uh, just tell me a little bit about yourself. Where are you from? Uh, where, which school do you go to? Uh, which book do you study, and so on? Just tell a little bit. Where are you from? Well, I'm from Russia. I'm studying in Batryva. Uh, this is a village in Chuvash Republic. Mm -hmm. I'm I study in in the middle school. I'm in eleventh class, mm -hmm. and I, um, <clears throat> my English book is Spotlight. Okay. Uh, but uh, you said that it was uh, Olympiad. Where was this Olympiad? Was it in your village or did you go to the city or what? Just um, <clears throat> Okay. It was in my village. Mm -hmm. um, uh, this was a um, municipal. Mm 
mm, step round yeah round rounded okay mm -hmm. round and step and mm, i i didn't have to go to the city or other village <clears throat> i'm i stayed at my own school okay yeah i understand so and uh, was it uh, reading listening uh writing or uh, speaking what kind of a contest was that oh <clears throat> in the tasks uh there are um, all these kinds of um, exercises mm -hmm. uh there was uh, listening there was a uh, reading um and uh the tasks um mm, which are named as uh use of english i think it is it was grammar maybe yeah. and vocabulary and also uh <clears throat> there was um, such um, such task um, i um, what was what, what, what? <clears throat> I wrote uh, how how it's in English a project about COVID nineteen. Oh, yeah. COVID nineteen. Sorry. Okay. <clears throat> uh, I compared different on. Uh, um, I compared uh, the numbers in the table and wrote about the what. what about the people um, who was vaccinated in different countries. Okay. Are you vaccinated? No, I'm only 17 now. Oh, okay. Yeah, but uh, you know, I heard that probably before the end of uh, this year, it will be it will be possible for all of the kids to be vaccinated in Russia. Also, have you heard of that? No. No, maybe. <laughs> okay, yeah, that's uh, very good. And uh, did you have the speaking part? Mm, no. Okay, yeah, I understand. So, do you speak English during your English classes? Mm, in my school, I yeah. usually I I don't speak in English because we we do the grammar tasks or listening but i do <clears throat> speaking um no i speak at my um, during my lessons in my online school um, um, and what's all okay what kind of an online school um <laughs> uh, can you oi can i <clears throat> um, can i not to not to to not to tell about the name of school but i i study twice a week for for two hours um, with the teacher and my group um we study at the zoom and we also use the microphone during the lesson okay very well so but uh all right. How many students do you have in the group? Um, <clears throat> usually, um, there there are uh, fifteen or seventeen um, people in the group, but uh, there, but only ten or twelve people go to the go to the um, to the the lessons mm -hmm. uh, is it expensive mm, i think it is mm, not expensive for uh <clears throat> for it because um there are many mm, tasks every day uh which i <clears throat> which i must do on the platform or on their own site and in the every <clears throat> lesson I I speak with teacher and with others 
and I think it is important. Yeah, yeah. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, I totally agree with you. So, what do you usually talk about? Oh, um, usually <clears throat> uh, we do um, different tasks, but um, <clears throat> in area class we. Um, Mm -mm. the teacher split or oh, no 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 <laughs> do the groups mini groups um, of two people and i with my um with my um, what is with other person um we talk about uh different um, problems or we are uh, we answer um, on on the various questions, <laughs> okay. and and also we do <clears throat> um, tasks of tasks about no exam tasks. Okay. And uh, do, do we have a do you have a book or uh, they have uh, different tasks every time? Or do they have the tasks only for the Russian national exam? Mm. Um, okay, no. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, I understand. <clears throat> mm. We do Russian uh, national exam because um, the study is, or the school is, spe is specialized mm -hmm. at this exam. And um, I think uh, they are, um, they offer no they is it they? Mm -hmm. they offer yeah that's very ah, good offer, okay they offer um, tasks um, in from the uh well probably you are talking about fp website VP, yes tasks from fp from different sites uh, and i think it is is good okay very well, excellent. You know, and uh, your English is uh, very good. I'm very much impressed. Um, I, if you don't mind, uh, can you tell me just a little bit about this project uh, which you presented today about COVID-19, about this table or chart or whatever, because that's kind of interesting. Uh, can you oh, share? It, it was hard because I, I didn't, well, I haven't done it uh, <laughs> all. I do, <clears throat> I've done the middle of the task because I, I haven't made, uh, I haven't um, enough time for, for this. And I, <laughs> and I don't have uh, such vocabulary for this text because I, <laughs> I didn't know how to uh, translate different words, and uh, the table was so huge. So, and I was scared. <laughs> but I, <clears throat> but I did the description. I, I. <laughs> I I did the comparison, the some comparison, and what's all, what's what's yeah, all. But the, you know what I'm asking is just tell me about what you did. Um, just uh, tell me about this COVID uh, stuff, about these comparisons, mm -hmm. like you're saying. Just I I want to know. I want to understand. You <laughs> said that you you were scared. <laughs> I don't think that you you were supposed to be scared. <laughs> because you know this is kind of a regular normal uh, exam task so you you are supposed to kind of a, get used to it so do not be scared please if you i think that if you tell it uh, right now over again i think that it will be very helpful for you and i will like to listen to it a lot please go ahead okay it's mm. It's um, difficult for me <laughs> to talk, to speak about this same theme. Um, well, what comparison I've done? Um, <clears throat> oh. 
I noticed that um, in the poor um, countries, uh, the number of people who are vaccinated from COVID-19, uh, it's um, smaller than, <clears throat> than the European countries or other uh, wealthy <laughs> countries. Uh, and I, um, I, 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 I guess, I guess, um, what is because what is what it is happening because the poor, um, the people in the poor countries, um, um, don't have enough information about uh, the situation in the world, <clears throat> and um, and it is also mentioning that in the poor countries um, the education education system is also bad and people or no 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 people mm -mm -mm. <clears throat> okay people do not understand how it is important to to do the vaccine to live in safety in 21 century and what's all what I have done about the poor countries and also I I wrote that in such countries as um, no in countries um, there is a tourist which are um, addictive for tourists which are the <clears throat> in which there are many um, cultural um, centers or hotels or uh, where the people go to them uh, in the summer maybe uh, <clears throat> and in that countries the number of people who uh, was who <clears throat> who was vaccinated uh, is well, um, is bigger? No. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's good. okay. You can say bigger. You can say larger. That's all right. La larger, yes, um, <clears throat> larger. And I, um, I, um, I thought, I think this because um, in this country, in in this in these countries uh, well do, do not switch into the russian language and you will find your own word oh, because, okay. yeah. please do it's a bit difficult <laughs> no it's not difficult yeah you can do that uh, well, the, the difficult part is when you switch into the Russian language. That's the difficult part. Do not do that. <laughs> Just uh, try to find another word uh, because, you know, when you switch into the Russian language, then you will definitely lose the train of thought. And uh, this is not a very good thing. Um, you just, when you are there in the English language, stay there, <laughs> do not go back to the Russian language. It's, it, this is what is hard. When you switch from one language to another, do not switch it. Okay. Okay, I'll try. <laughs> yeah, sure, of course, and you will manage. <clears throat> well, I <laughs> I will continue. Mm -hmm. uh, mm, a large number of people go to the to these countries mm -hmm. to mm, to relax. No. Mm, to the trip, maybe. Uh, and there are many people in one place, in one time, and I think um, people should uh, do vaccine in these countries, in the wealthy or um, popular countries, uh, to <clears throat> to to no no. For, sa for their safety mm -hmm. and the administration, the uh, owners, 
the maybe hostel no mm, i say administration mm -hmm. uh all administration should be uh vaccinated to do not share no uh, that the virus to <clears throat> to be safe from the virus oh i i don't remember the, the word <laughs> no what's all what uh, what i written <laughs> in this desk very well so how about uh, you yourself uh, were you sick with the uh, coronavirus or no you didn't get oh. sick you, you were not sick with the coronavirus uh yes i have sick uh, in the last year and it it was <laughs> awful thing okay yeah, i'm so sorry about that no but i'm alive and what's good <laughs> yeah that's, <laughs> that's excellent but uh, um, anyway, uh, like you said, it was uh, real hard, right? Mm, yes, but um, I was lucky. I, I was ill for two days only. Oh, okay. So did the, it was possible to smell? Did you feel? Yes, yes. It was the, um, the light, um, mm -hmm, the light yeah. version of Yes. COVID, but I, I, I didn't do the test. Mm, it, mm, it's, it's merely the prediction. Okay, mm. but uh, how do you know that it was COVID? Probably, maybe it was mm. not COVID. Are you <laughs> sure? I think that because my parents mm -hmm. also were sick, and my little brother also were sick uh but my <clears throat> no i have my brother mm, ill for two days mm -hmm. and um uh, <clears throat> and um, oh and about one um, week we 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 were sitting at home but my parents uh, mm, were sick for one or for, um, for almost one you know, week but they had the um, but the hardest version of covid 19. okay yeah i'm i'm very <clears throat> sorry about that okay yeah but anyway that's um like you said you got very lucky that um, you survived and uh, also your brother so the only thing which i just wanted to recommend you when you say something about uh you said i and my brother we usually say my brother and i oh okay yeah you I, just, yeah i remember yeah that's uh, you know it's a uh, kind of a um a little bit of a comment um all right very well so like you said that uh, you are the only student and it's 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 very normal because you know that i do not allow uh people to come to my class i i don't like when people come like you know these boys uh, who do not want to speak english they just want to make something bad uh, during the class um to draw some bad pictures or you know to use some bad vocabulary so that is why i i do not like a lot of people right now um so but um, anyway you are very welcome uh, come um the next time and uh, we will talk so how it goes uh, what we usually do and uh, believe me that uh, the most important part is uh, not the teacher I I can just uh, you know I can help you um, 
like I said, instead of I and my brother, I can just, uh, what I know 100% sure that uh, this is definitely will be better if you say it like that. But otherwise, everything uh, is being done by the students, uh, if you can understand. So my role is just mostly I listen. I tend not to talk a lot. Um, and so usually we discuss what we call a big question. And a big question comes uh, from the students. Um, what kind of a big questions? Well, maybe it's uh, necessary for you to discuss something about these uh, projects in uh, Russian national exam. Uh, you just tell me and I will do whatever I can. Um, and I will try and help you. But most of the time, students, they offer um, topics about what happened uh, in their life, um, in their school life or, you know, everyday life. Um, let me just give you a couple of examples. So sometimes uh, um, students can ask the question like, why wouldn't uh, the students from 11th grade, like you are from the 11th grade, 11th year, it's uh, whatever you call it. So why wouldn't students uh, read uh, the classical literature? Why wouldn't, why students do not like reading classical literature? Um, or another big question, and we just discussed that, or another big, big question was, um, you know that uh, your home uh, school teacher, home school teacher in uh, Russian is something like Klasny Rukovoditel, home school teacher, um, uh, home teacher, sorry. I, I was just thinking about another um, uh, thing. So this teacher will ask the students to help in some way, you know, to organize some event um, like, um, you know, maybe something fun for other students. And uh, most of the students will tell, no, I will not take part in that. I don't what I'm not interested and so on. Then so the, the students will come up to me and discuss the questions like that. Or um, that's, I think that this is enough uh, about the examples and uh, just the question to you. Uh, do you think that uh, we can discuss some kind of a big question for you right now. Do you think you have a big question to discuss? Oh, I understand. Uh -huh. But <laughs> uh, just give me just give me a second. Yeah. I... Yeah. Sure. Of course. Yeah. Feel free. Absolutely. That's not a problem. I need some minutes to. Yeah. Sure. Of course. I will just um, uh, watch a little bit of the latest news. Um, you will start talking and I will immediately turn off. To stand trial in the US. Me to change. Now is the time for a new impulse. Moving from a stable ground to a tipping point. Now is the time to be ahead. Now is the time for agility for sustainable acts. Now is your time. Check this out. It hasn't been such a long time since people first started shopping online and it was easy to keep up with the clicks. Little by little by little by more, the clicks added up to be more than the stores and e-tailers worked harder than ever before because they had to keep up with the clicks. No time for borders, got to stay in control, to stay in the flow and continue to grow. But real help. I've, I've inspired. Okay. All right. Hello. Go ahead. I watched this video and I think what we, what we can talk about the career, work, or maybe um, different skills, because now I am developing my uh, vocabulary, vocabulary about this um, uh, topic. And I think it is it would be good to talk about something like that. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. So uh, do you have uh, some uh, specific question in mind? Do you want to ask me about uh, the professional career or you want to talk about your prof uh, professional career? Um, I, I, I just want to, uh, to understand. So mm -hmm. what, what are you going to do after the uh, high school? After the high school, I, I want to go to the... <clears throat> I want to go to the university mm -hmm. and my um, um, I wish I I I wish I will be the economist mm -hmm. and uh, because I uh, with I want to be economist I I need to no I have to pass the English exam and uh, just so social 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 studies social studies yes mm, i know uh, at the moment i don't know where where i will i'll work but i think it will it it may be may be interesting for me oh, I, how how can i call you is it uh, your real name, this Akulina? Is it your name? Yes, uh, I'm Akulina. Yeah, and uh, do you have uh, something like shorter? Um, mm. How do friends no. call you? Just no. Akulina? The same. Okay, Akulina. All right, very well. So um, you said that uh, uh, in order to get to the university, you have to take uh, the exams in uh, uh, in English in something else, but uh, what kind of a university is that? If you want to become the economist, you have to take the English exam. I I, I don't don't oh. understand why. What kind of a university is that? Mm, I think the mm, the best uni the best the best economical economic university in Russia is. Uh, one second. Oh, high uh, school, high school of economics. High school, yes, high school, but of uh, economics. High, high school think... of economics. It's a uh, school of economics, right? High school of economics. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. I think it is difficult to to go to get to get to mm -hmm. go to go get to to get to get there for me because I <laughs> I don't understand English enough and I. But and however, I start. I I'm studying now. I'm developing my English. But I <clears throat> I I don't hope to get there. It's only for 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 this moment. Maybe in June or in July. <laughs> I, I, I'll send my documents to there, <laughs> but um, I think I can, <clears throat> I can get to the Ran Hicks. Um, okay. It is a Russian yeah, ac academy, academy of, uh, uh, yeah, um, of I am the president. Yeah. Okay. Yes. And no. Um, For this moment, I, I, I haven't thought about the university. I'll go because I now I own I only preparing my for my exams, and it it will be in the future, in the near future, and what's all. All right, yeah, just uh, let me share the screen with you. Um, because you know how we usually work with that. Now, can you see my screen? Yes. And so you see, this is what you call uh, the, uh, this type of academy, right? Mm -hmm. But then uh, you want to say it in English, correct? And so if you scroll down, you will see the uh, button English, okay? Okay. You click this button and then you have the version of in English, which is necessary for you to know. And I think that 
um, it will be helpful for you to know how it's called. So Russian Presidential Academy of National Economy and Public Administration. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Yeah, very well. Um, yeah, that sounds kind of uh, interesting. But uh, um, so in both um, in, in, in both uh, scenarios, you will have to take the English exam, right? Both in uh, a Russian presidential academy and uh, uh, the higher um, school of economics, you will have to take the English exam. Yes, I'll I'll take the English exam. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, <clears throat> and what what's the question? Uh, I, why why economy? Why economy? Yes. Uh, well, <laughs> when I <clears throat> when I when I thought when I had been thought uh, about my future career or my future job, I <laughs> I didn't understand uh, what um, what what I want. I think I <clears throat> I think I. I preferred it because I'm I'm good in maths and I I'm good I'm I am good in social studies and um, I I have been improving it and um, in in <clears throat> in February of this this year I. I um, I've no uh, I've no, I have known but I need to take the English exam. Okay. All right. And yeah. I yes. started I started preparing for for yeah, this. Very well. And uh, you know, you like you're saying you've been improving a lot and uh, you've been doing absolutely a fantastic job. Uh, your English is very very good, believe me because you know I have uh, a chance, I have uh, the experience of talking to so many students, you won't believe, during my uh, very long life. And I know that you've been doing a very good job um, and uh, keep on doing the same stuff. Now, I just, uh, because, uh, you know, we have only a couple of minutes to go and then uh, we'll finish. As I said, uh, these classes are only 40 minutes. Mm -hmm. So, um, like you said that uh, you've been uh, doing uh, a very good job about um, how to improve uh, your vocabulary so the question to you is how do you improve your vocabulary what do you oh. do? yeah <laughs> i am studying in in my online school mm -hmm. there i there there i can get them uh, different words and we also <clears throat> in every lessons we um, we playing different uh, vocabulary games such as kahoot such as um yeah i know formative and i um, and i love um, to learn new words in quizlet uh, this is a uh, application in my phone there i <clears throat> they I search words and also I I sometimes I I read the boy read yeah, no 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 sometimes I read uh, books in, on English and I I try to translate <laughs> I try <laughs> Yeah, so uh, that's that's uh, mostly was uh, my question about um, books. Just uh, you know, as uh, um, as a scientist, I uh, I know a lot that if you think of your vocabulary, the the best way, the shortest way to improve your vocabulary is uh, through reading good books. So um, now, what is uh, like you said that you read? Uh, uh, the book in English. So, what was the book? What is the name of the book? Oh, 
<clears throat> my first book was uh, Little Prince. Mm -hmm. uh, my second book was uh, Forrest Gump of David Groom. Oh, mm -hmm. no, David Groom's book named Forrest Gump. And now I now I am reading uh, the book, which is named The Financier. And the author is Dreiser. Dreiser, yes. Yeah, but <laughs> how did you how did you find this book? Because this is kind of a not very popular book nowadays. Oh, I I read only thirty or fifty sheets, but I find it <laughs> interesting. Pages. Mm, but it's Mm, it's a bit difficult. There are many new words, new uh, no, uh, and old words. Yes, right. Mm. That's what I was thinking about. But I'm asking, who recommended you to read this book? How, uh, how did you get to know about this book in the first place? I've gone to the, to the, to the, to the book. Mm. What bookstore? bookshop? Yes, mm -hmm. bookshop, and I, <laughs> I, I've chosen this book in <laughs> that, <clears throat> but I, uh, before that, I, uh, <laughs> I would, I would like to read this book in Russian, but. Uh, when I when I saw it uh, uh, on the shelves, I uh, I I bought it. Okay. Yeah, uh, that's very good. All right. Um, so Agarina, it was uh, uh, real good uh, to talk uh, to you, and uh, thank you so much for uh, this. Uh, thank you too. Yeah. Uh, if you uh, you are just welcome. If you want to. Uh, if you would like to, you can join my classes anytime uh, next time. Uh, but uh, that's that's it for now. If you have uh, some questions, you can just ask me questions and we, we will be done for today. So if you have any questions. Oh, 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 one second. That's OK. Uh, if you could, if you can, if you can hear. Yes, uh, I can. Yeah, there I can. is some. Mm, what is sound? sound mm, around me but uh can you <laughs> uh, re, re, re. Mm, tell me your question again please I, I i was just asking if you have any questions to me before we finish oh oh uh, well <laughs> i I want to ask why it why it's free. It's 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 good. It's why it's free. You mean uh, this this lesson? Why is this lesson free or free of charge? Why yes uh, yes. Why it's free? Uh, you mean free uh, free of charge without uh, paying money? Yes. <laughs> it's it's kind of a well. It's it's a promotion. It's an advertisement um i i've been doing that for let's see for almost 10 years now every friday friday yes yes why why i haven't heard it uh, in the last time uh, it doesn't matter it's an excellent lesson i think yeah thank you uh, it, it was an excellent lesson because of you because of your good english all right, but uh, thank you for your kind words. All right, yep. Any other questions? Mm, and and the last question: mm -hmm. Have you any your own um, course courses or maybe school? Do you have? Well, I actually I have uh, just my private classes online. If you want to, it's uh, usually I do not use Zoom. I uh, but it's possible if you like uh, Zoom, it's possible to use Zoom. Um, usually we do it through Skype, uh, but uh, any other platform, like you said, it's it's okay with me. 
So that's uh, we can do that if you want to. Oh, well, what's good? Yeah, sure, of course. If uh, you want to, you can write me a message, and uh, you know where to write it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And, uh, yeah, you're very welcome. Okay, I will. I will think about it. Yes, sure, of course. All right. Um, so uh, see you later. And um, bye bye okay. for now. Goodbye. Thank you for the lesson. Thank it you. Was great.